that there used to be a well back there where a little girl fell into and died. Was your death an accident? Oh my god. Guys? Those are spreading. That's a no? It's like... Okay. Cool. Love that. Wait, is that door? There's no way! I literally just recorded the door. No, 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 no. I'm not going down there. Hell no. What? I'm not going down there. Alright, well, I'm gonna put. Oh! oh, oh. Okay! Find the dog! That's what oh said that. my yeah, that's said that. Hey, Morty! You know what's funny? Guys, a flashlight. The flashlight. The flashlight. flashlight. Oh my gosh. And you know what's funny? I said, I said, we're gonna put you back in the box unless you give us something. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, oh, there it is oh again. my god. See, he's scared to go back in the box. I've had some of the craziest experiences of my life here in terms of paranormal, in terms of like unexplainable events. This is where I've had the most. Absolutely. And let's go check out the rest of this place. I can't over it. I literally can't. I'm, I'm terrified. When I find energy, I'm walking downstairs. I'm not coming back up here. Chris? What the f What's up everybody, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another insanely scary video. Tonight's footage is from a night where my friend Chris and I traveled to a very haunted hotel in New York known as the Shanley Hotel. We were actually accompanied with our very special guests, Mo Sarji and Exploring with Angelo. This night was insane. By the end of the night, I completely lost myself. We'll get into that in a little bit, but a lot of people have not seen this video. You guys are loving the re-uploads here on the second channel. Like I mentioned, there was a time where I was doing completely separate content on the main channel and then i would sprinkle in a haunted video every couple of months some of you may have seen these videos most of you have not according to the comment section a lot of you guys thought the last video i uploaded was like literally a couple of days ago but yeah that's just uh how it was but yeah I, you guys are loving these re-uploads i'm going to continue to do them but this night was insane uh there's something about this hotel that just keeps drawing me back and i'm not sure like what it is but it was weird. Uh, one of the first times I came here, I saw this kid running outside. I went to go get something from the car and I saw this kid running in the backyard of the hotel and I'm like, why is there a kid? Like, what is this kid doing? So I went inside and to the owner, I was like, hey, is that your kid out there running around? They're like, uh, no, there's no kids here. Like no one in the neighborhood lets their kids outside. I was like, why? They're like, well, there's a maximum security prison literally down the road. And I was like, oh, well, that, that makes sense. But I was like, so what, what kid was that that I saw that? They're like, that was the spirit of the child that died here in the well. And by the end of the night in this video that you're about to watch, I was, something was over me. I was literally outside barefoot staring where this child supposedly passed. And yeah, it was a crazy night. So all I'm gonna say is get ready for this video guys. Smash the like button if you are enjoying them and you wanna see more videos like this. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoy. If you wanna see more re-uploads, let me know down below. And uh, yeah, big shout out to my friends, Chris, Mo, and Angelo. Love you guys, and uh, see you in a little bit. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel, and welcome back to another paranormal investigation video. Today, I'm here at the Haunted Shanley Hotel, and I've already been here twice. This is the third time and the last time that I will ever come here. The reason I say that is because I've already been here twice, and it was absolutely crazy and terrifying the first two times I came here. Now, this third time is going to top that. And I say that with confidence because we're gonna be pushing the absolute boundaries in this video. We're gonna be doing things that we've never done before. Rituals, seances. We're gonna be using equipment that we've never used before. So it's going to get absolutely crazy. So if you are excited for this video and you wanna see more, make sure to smash that like button on this video. If this video gets 15,000 likes, we'll be doing more paranormal investigation videos. Make sure to comment down in the comment section below where you want us to go investigate next. So 
with all that being said, Chris, you ready? I'm not, but yeah. <laughs> yeah. This is Chris's first time here, so this is gonna be pretty interesting. Today's opposite so. day. All right, so let's go ahead and give you guys a tour of this building. All right, guys, so we are in a very, very small town. It's basically a ghost town, and we're going to somewhere that Honestly, I had some of the craziest experiences in my life. This is the last time I'm ever going here. We're literally down the street. Look at that shit. Look at the lights. This is a great warm welcome. The lights are all literally flickering on this road. Spooky. Well, I was gonna say, um, I've been here twice before. This is my third and final time I'm ever coming here. And I think we're gonna go all out because I feel like I have some questions that I need answers to from this area, and uh, here she is. The famous haunted Shanley Hotel. Whew. Let's pull in. Bring back any memories or anything? Uh, only bad ones, I'll tell you that much. That's good. All right, well, we're here, and uh, It's bringing back bad memories already. Uh, this time I brought Chris with me, and Chris hasn't been here before. But when I tell you, Chris, I've had some of the craziest experiences of my life here in terms of paranormal, in terms of like unexplainable events. This is where I've had the most. Absolutely. I've seen the videos. I've watched a ton of them. I definitely. I mean, I don't want to be here. This isn't like something I want to do, but like, I don't want like if. God forbid Mo and Angel didn't show up. I don't want you to be here alone. Right. Well. And Jen's not coming back. Ben yeah, and Xavier yeah. aren't coming back. I brought a group with me last time. I brought my girlfriend and two friends. All three of them refused to come with me. To they refused. Day. So I brought it up again this past weekend. I was like, guys, it's just I'm throwing it out there. I got it rented if you guys want it. They said, absolutely not. No money in the world. Like, that would be offered to them. Would they come back here? So... I'm here with Chris. Chris uh, luckily agreed to come. So the thing is, Chris, we got to go inside. We got to go sign a waiver just in case anything what happens to us. What? A so, waiver? Just in case you get hurt, it's a liability. Now, I asked, I asked her. Hurt? The second I asked her about this waiver, she told me the same week a lady was dragged from the second floor to the first floor down the stairs, like hurt her back and neck really, really bad. So. There's that. Um, here's the thing. We're not going to be alone tonight. We have two other people that are going to be in this building investigating, but they're going to be doing their own thing. They're going to be doing their own video. Chris and I are going to try to investigate this by ourselves for the most part and see if whatever, you know, experience we're going to we're gonna be doing seances, Ouija boards, all types of equipment is going to be used tonight to see if we could, you know, get some evidence. So with that being said, you ready? I'm ready. Let's go. Let's go sign these waivers. Alrighty. Well, let's start this night off with just a quick little run through of the building since this is Chris's first time. And um, come on in. Come on in. Thanks for having me. Of course. Well, um, so this right here is like the. Let me make sure this is closed. This is the guidelines room. So basically, they have all like the, the gifts, the shirts, and stuff like that. So let's go upstairs. Oh, I'll watch my house. Be careful. Tell me this isn't the creepiest hallway you've ever seen in your life. Horrors. Now, scary, right? <laughs> All of these rooms are named. So if you look up here, this is Rose's room. This is Oscar Grover. But basically, this is what a lot of the rooms look like. They must. Yeah, we're going to investigate the majority of this place, so. A little rundown. Roosevelt. This is where uh, Eleanor Roosevelt stayed. Oh, wait, she stayed here? Yeah. Want to put the airplane? What? The girl who the airplane? <laughs> <laughs> There's no way. There's no way you just said that. <laughs> Take something else. The, the owners are 
being in this room, so we have to avoid this room. This is the silent room. This is violent. Who's that? Well, we should have stayed here. We could have bunked up. Yeah, we still could. We're on top of each other. We're both in. Let's go check up upstairs. Upstairs is creepy. There's more? Oh no. This is... This is technically the attic. So, let's go check this out. Now this is like unfinished. A lot of it's unfinished, so... It's terrifying. Yeah. Oh jeez, that scared the hell out of me. That big chair right there. You're not supposed to sit in this chair. Like if you want to sit in this chair, you have to ask permission or you'll really upset the spirit that's in this room. Should we post the caution tape on or no? Is that a good idea? This is new. I have not seen this last time. Well, all right then. Just a bunch of balls. Have you ever seen one of these? I swear the train is supposed to spin. <laughs> Somebody can hang on there and I won't keep it myself. <laughs> okay. Screw it up. Let's get out of here. This is wild. Wow, look at the chairs in this room. I like this. Why are they all like in a circle like this? I don't know. We could possibly do a seance in here. So that's good to keep for later. Oh, wow. No, 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 no. I don't like this. What is this? It's like an unfinished room, basically. There's a drawer. Holy! Holy! Hold on. Yo, you know what's crazy? Those are motion sensing lights on the floor that would have went off if yeah. someone came up here mm -hmm. or something. I'm good though. I'm already good. That wasn't like behind the door or anything? We have to rewatch that footage to see like where this bowl was. Yeah. Holy shit. The had to have been from the toy room, right? I mean, it's where all the toys are. If I had to guess, then yeah. Chills, absolute chills. I didn't think it starts so early. Yeah, look at all these bells. What the? Was there other people back there or something? What? What was that? You don't hear that? No, I don't. What are you? Holy shit, what is that over there? Dude, I'm seeing like some, something like written on the floor over there. Hell no. I want to go check this out, but we have to go oh, from the other side. Wait, what do you hear? This is like a painted building. Or I literally sound like a little girl like laughing or something. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of this place right now. So here's the thing. <sighs> Ooh, we're starting early. We're getting some evidence and activity right now. We're like, what, five minutes into this? We just started. So. Mo and Angela, they're on the complete other side of the building. There's like two sections to this building. They're already investigating that part because they've been here for a while. So Chris and I were like, you know what? Let's go just give you guys a tour of the main building. Now we're going to spend a lot of time in this area uh, doing some spear boxes, doing some just investigation. I'm actually going to check this room over here. That's spooky as hell, but okay. All right. Um, I really want to go check what's on the other side of over there. But I guess oh, what we could do take is, you through them. I'm sorry. What we could do is we could use something like this chair. Because there's, like, there's no way behind the chair, right? There's not a person right there. Yeah. Motion. Motion, 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 motion sensing. Hold on. You heard that, right? Yeah. The camera heard that too. 
Chris, it was that one. That one's on. That one's off. So there has been no motion on that one. That one. Hold on, split up right now. Look, that just turned on the battery. So hold on. For what? Where do you want me to go? Oh. Get the shit out of me. Some of you and dolls. This is wild. Yeah, you're so. See, look. Bro, there's a hole in the photo. You be careful. It's not for me. That was definitely hard for you. Oh, wow. Chris? No, 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 I gotta go. I gotta go. Bro, this is in the floor. This is literally in the floor. Look at that. This isn't a board. Insane. Wow, okay, we gotta play this later. Hey, you should come in and have fun, for sure. Chris isn't a fan of Luigi boards. <laughs> no, sir. This is crazy. We we gotta come back up here with some ghost equipment. We have a ton to use. Like we have music boxes, we have spirit boxes. It's gonna be crazy. The whole package. So this is terrifying. The soccer room's all here. Thank you. Washed up. Washed up my ass. I'm in Crocs. Sticking out stickers. <laughs> I've been blocking black and cracks and socks. Right, let's go. Show you guys a little bit. That was crazy. You didn't hear that? It was like, uh? You didn't hear that? I needed answers. Yo. Hello. Yo. What's up, bro? Well, what's going on? That was a lot crazy of shit. Just happened upstairs. Really? Yeah, we're literally just getting started. We got some crazy shit. Where's Angelo? What happened? Where's Angelo? I don't know. I haven't seen him in a while. I'm gonna double check. I'm just make sure. Cause this is a complete other side of the building right now. Angelo? He's up there. Yo! Yeah, what's up? Not much. Oh, what's up? Yeah. What's Why is a spear box on in our bedroom? I don't know, man. It is loud. I was up here, then all of a sudden it just started going louder, and then it went quieter, and... This is weird. Hey, turn this off. We definitely turned this off earlier. We did. Yeah, absolutely. We did. I don't even know how to turn it off. Mo turned it off last time. Dude, we just had the craziest experience up in the attic. Really? Yeah, so we went into like the little room with all the balls and stuff. Yeah. And then we went to another room and a ball rolled into our room. Really? We went back in there, we were investigating everything. Could not like doesn't make sense. The motion sensor thing went yeah. off as well. But this oh, just yeah? stopped. The voices were wild and they just stopped. Yeah, why did I don't it, understand. You literally saw me. I like, thought a song was playing. It just kept like going. Voice, voice, every voice. Yeah. yeah. Well, I'm going to shut this off now. That's what it did to me last time. It literally made me come downstairs. I'm like, what the hell? Why is this playing? Yeah, yeah we're off to a crazy start. Yeah. I'm going to go get some equipment and then we'll be back in those rooms. We'll be, uh, you know, firing up some of the spear box apps and stuff. So let's see if we could get any responses, any cool activity. So mm -hmm. let's do it. So the history of this hotel is very, very dark and it goes a long, long ways back. But there was a lot of uh, spirits that were laid to rest on the premises, inside of this building, underneath this building. So th there's a lot going on. Uh, one of the most active areas is right over here. 
Back in? No. Oh. The Bordello. Is that a, oh, is that the beer we're drinking? Bordello, right? No. This, this, my friend, is a brothel. And the lights are all off. What the hell? Uh, so yeah, this is a brothel. What was that? What do you hear? What's this? That's our boss. Oh, okay. Is it now? Let's go check it out. I could be wrong. Can you turn the lights on? No, no, let's go. What do you mean? Oh, wow, dude. Why the hell is this one room just have the light on? No other rooms except this room. Hell no. The floor is so cool. This is uh, Anna's room. So Anna... Who's Anna? Was a, uh, a hooker. So. Is she in there? Depends who's asking. <laughs> um, so for, you can tell right here. She accepts money. She'll talk to you if you bring her money. I'm a, I'm a card only person, so. <laughs> hey, I got 20 bucks in my pocket. Yeah. Ooh. She might put this on for that. <laughs> really? <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Oh. Well, try and be respectful, but. Um, oh, I'm just joking. Yeah, this is. That was really weird. There was like a. You saw Impression? that, like an imprint? I just kind of. Probably shouldn't have done that, but it's just really weird. Why is the light in this room on? The heels. Oh, that's so creepy. There's heels. There's a like a little booklet. Yeah, rocking chair. Earrings. Too bad they definitely didn't have king size beds back then. Did they? Not a lot of room to do activities. Yeah, there was a lamp. Um. Well, we should not... we should never turn the lights on. Huh? We should turn the lights on. This is wild. Bro. I'm trying. The switch is over there too. None of these lights are working for long. Oh, there's another dress. That scared the shit out. Okay. Jeez, well, sparkles. Some equipment that we have. This right here is called a REM pod. For this to go off, you have to literally be right next to it, touching it. So look at this. Like, look how close I have to be for this to go off. And it has multiple sensors depending on where you're touching it. So I'm gonna go place this over here somewhere. Right at, actually, I'll place it on the table. There you go. This is another sensor. What do you want me? I'll be moving around. This is another sensor, but this is a music box. So this goes off when there's motion detected in front of it, which is pointing at you right now. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna place this down the stairs. So if anything's coming upstairs or going downstairs, we will get a notification. The hell was that? I don't know. Like a tapping? You. Yeah. <laughs> While I'm putting that up. But I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna fire up Necrophonic right now. So if you wanna take a seat, let's home. go ahead and ask some questions. So right here we have the spirits of Anna, Maddie, and Rosie. Let's see if we can get anything out of these three resting spirits. Okay. Hello, is there any spirits with us in this room right now? Nah. There's not yet. <laughs> okay. Anna, are you here with us tonight? I, I literally didn't move. I did not move. I'm not moving right now. Bro, hold on, hold on. Let me stop this for a second. Oh my gosh. Yo, that's crazy. That's Anna. It has to be. I'm literally not close enough for it to go off. Yeah, give me a camera. It's hurting my ears. What the hell? Okay, how about we go place this somewhere else? How about we place this right? Look at that. You have to literally touch it for it to go off. So place it right there. Let me go ahead. That was I said is this is that Anna and that went off immediately. Let's try that again. <laughs> Anna, was that you making that device over there go off? I'd like to introduce myself. My name is Yasko. I'm here with my buddy Chris. And we're just trying to contact with you really nice people. Just... 
So do I. What is the name that just said God? What is the name of the spirit who is touching that device right now? Say all of them? All of them. Said mm. twice. That's, it was like a little girl thing. But I heard all of them after you said it. That's crazy. Do you mind if me and Chris stay here and film? Don't do it. Or don't. Okay. Ooh, it got cold all of a sudden. What was that? I don't know. We're gonna lie one. That's for Maddie. Or Rose. Rose. Okay. Maddie, are you here with us right now? Rosie, are you here with us? Rosie. Rosie. Oh, <laughs> <that what> you <laughs> heard? Oh, oh my goodness. That Rose. Rosie. Well, Rosie, it's very nice to meet you. Oh, it's gonna be chills, all right. All right, Rosie, I'm gonna come in your room. Chris is gonna stay here. As soon as you stood up. Literally the second you stood up. What is going on right now? Okay, Rosie, I'm coming inside your room right now. Rosie don't want that. This is crazy. All right, Rosie, do you mind if I sit on your bed? Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Right? Bro, this thing is not stopping. Should you turn this off or what? Yeah. I'm looking a little deaf. Is that wow. the temperature part? Isn't there like a temperature and heat part? I don't know. Yeah, one. I think it's... Um, 62 degrees in here. Right now. Let me see. There's a couple different settings on it. Okay. One was just the motion, I think. I could be wrong. But that's what I thought Angelo said earlier. Let's try it out again. I don't know. I have that set up again. I swear to God, when I said, can I, can I sit on your bed? I heard lay. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to try to lay down on Rosie's bed right now. I'm gonna keep this on while I ask questions. If you wanna come up and you know stand right here as well, I'm gonna bring this with me. All right, Rosie, I'm coming in. I'm gonna, I'm gonna sit down and lay on your bed, okay? You see everything? Rosie, it's very nice to meet you. I appreciate you letting me lay on your bed. They move? I heard you move it. Okay, I will move down for you. Thank you. Rosie, are these all your toys right here against the wall? This whole one? Rosie, are you on this bed with me right now? Rosie, is that a picture of you right there? Hey, no. Rosie, who is a picture of? <laughs> yo, yo, the REM pod, the REM pod. It is beeping. Who, who's making the REM pod go off? You? Rosie, is that a picture of you right there? Rosie? Anybody? Shh, who's that? You? What the fuck? There's no way, hold on, hold on. Hold on.
Oh right after we just heard God. evil. God. Bro, the REM pod is going. It's crazy. still going. Hold on, hold on, hold on. The REM pod is still going. It's not beeping, but I try to like dumb down the sound a little bit. I wish these lights would turn on. Jeez. Oh, hold on. We're not. We're not that close. Wait, that light just turned on? I turned on, I turned on, I turned on. Holy shit, shoot. There's the last one I should try. Bro, what is going on? Hold on, that happened. Why is this happening? Why is this happening all at once right now? You, you guys still have the app out? Just ask questions. Okay. But the sound's not supposed to be going on. Oh, if I... You literally Stop saw it. it. it was Turn off for a sec, then. You, you literally saw it. It was going off without sound earlier. Yeah. Why did it just change its mind and just say, you know what? What happened was I... Somebody was messing with it. I went like this, nothing. Yeah. This one, I turned that on. What the hell is that sound, though? I don't know. It sounded so like running or something closing. Scraping. Right? Man, this is crazy right now. All right. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to turn off Annie's light as well. Doesn't. Okay, let's try this again. Wow, we got some crazy activity right now, guys. Keep in mind, um, I do want to say this, that Chris and I are still amateurs at this, I would say. And um, we're going to be upping the equipment throughout this video. Right now, we're just using the Necrophonic app, which is tremendous with activity and evidence. But later, we're going to be using some very expensive equipment, thanks to the owner of this building. We're going to be using these massive spear boxes. We're going to be doing seances with them and uh, rituals. We're basically going to be putting on headphones where we're going to be trying to talk to the other side. And she mentioned something about a portal to the other side as well. They have it in the basement where there was a morgue. So where bodies were buried. Let's go ahead and keep this going. Chris, why don't you ask a question or two? Okay. You ready? Yeah. Here, let me take the camera. Just go ahead and press start. What's the money there? What's up? For Manny, yeah. What's up? Cap for? However. <laughs> All right. Can uh, you let us know who's here with us right now? Who's in the room? Rosie. Oh my God. I said Rosie. No way. Yo, the chills on my arm right now. Hello. Rosie, are you here right now? Oh my gosh. Yo, I think Rosie likes you. No way. No. <laughs> She's <like> no. <laughs> no. Okay. <laughs> we got that out of the way. Oh man. Rosie, can you light up this little red light over here? Can you go near the red light for us? Make that light up. Oh, you're a dude. That's not nice. Do anything. Do you guys want us to leave? No. No. Okay. Do you guys need anything? Do you guys need help getting to the other side? Do you want us to pray for you? Yeah. Demon. Okay, that's always a great sign. Love that. Demon. Rosie, are you still here? There's demon again. Well, sometimes demons like to act as if they're kind spirits as a manipulation tactic. I mean, yeah, it's true. Still, man, I don't, I don't like that at all. How many of you are in the room with us right now? How many people are here? I thought I heard three, but I could be wrong. Chris? Let's just say Chris. Bro, stop. What? Five? Three plus two would be five, is all I'm saying. Okay. Do you like Chris? Do you want Chris to stay here with you guys forever? It's pretty comfy. I could stay here for a little bit. Yes. Oh, Chris, get comfy then. I'm about to bring it back. <laughs> Anna, that just, I literally looked up and I heard Anna. Oh my god. Anna, gosh. are you here with us right now as well? 
I have an idea. We're only missing Maddie. Can we hear from Maddie? Pray. Pray. All right. So, Anna was the prostitute. The hooker. She loved the money. This was worth a lot back in the day, I believe. 15 cents was probably a lot back then. Bro, change is hard to find today. Right? Yeah. That just, just blinking. What was that? No, I know it was blinking. Well, Anna, what can I get for 15 cents? I heard death. Anna, I'm gonna give you this 15 cents. There you go. Whatever you wanna do with me for that 15 cents. Massage? I, just I don't massage. like massage. I could go for a massage. My back is killing me. That's cheap. That's a good 100 bucks nowadays. The tip. Yeah, well, the owner told us to try and give Anna some money. That's the best way to get her to communicate. That's why I tried with the you 15 You said cents. you're. I heard that too. Wow. Do you guys want us to go lights out? Oh. Anna, can you do something for us? Make a sound? I heard Anna. Evil. Anna, can you do me a favor? Can you make the REM pod go off or... Oh shit. Literally pointed at it and it's blinking. Anna, thank you. That's yeah, awesome. Thank, thank you. you so much for that. Chris. Uh, no, that was Jazz who asked. I'm gonna take this over here. Anna, I'm gonna come in here, all right? Okay. Hello. That was very, very, like, that was like hello? Soft hello. Anna, I'm gonna lay down on this bed with you, okay? Ooh, this is crazy. Hi. Hello, Anna. Yeah. I'm the one who gave you the 15 cents. I'm here for my massage. Go away. Go away? But you told me. That was the shortest massage in my life. Who did I say F you? Yeah. Who <laughs> said like I said F you? I'm not even lying. Okay. Here's what I'm... Okay. I'm gonna pause real quick. So here's what I'm gonna do. Clearly we're getting a lot of activity from Anna and Anna's room. Yeah. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna try to lay down here and really just focus on talking to Anna. Okay. I gave Anna 15 cents and let's see what happens. So let's try this one more time. <laughs> Hi Anna. My name is Yasko. I'm the guy who gave you 15 cents. Just tell me to die. Yeah, I heard die. Cool. Well, you're a cheap date, Anna. I can tell you that much. Anna, what happened to you? Holy shit, there's a lot. How did you die, Anna? COVID? What? What? Um. I think it's just randomly going off right now. Who's making the REM pod go off right now? I'm not gonna say what that just said. Can you repeat that? Can you be more clear? Who is making that go off in the in the room right now? Bro, that's going crazy right now. I know. I just had enough of this dude. I was just these voices are wild. Like, what is he doing? It's not. It's not even on. It's not even on. It's literally not even on right now. It's not supposed to do this. Wait, hold on. Yo, what, what the hell? What is going on my phone? Hello? Hmm. 
Yo. What, what is going on? Like, no way. It's not supposed to do this. No, it's not. Should I restart the app? Probably. Okay, let me close that out. Fire up Necrophonic again. Yo, that's so creepy. Now let's just give it like a minute. Let's see if it happens again. Nothing. All right, so we'll just say it was a bug. That never happened. Yeah. Okay. Anna, are you here with us right now? Can you please just like give us a sign? Was that you making that sound on my app? I heard that. Yes. yes. Okay. How did you do that? Can you do it again? Can you make that same sound? Anna? Anna. What the hell? I've heard Anna multiple times. Anna, are you still here with us? Hi. Whose room am I in right now? Whose room am I in right now? <laughs> Rosie? No, we're in Anna's room. We're in Anna's room. We're in Anna's room. <laughs> Bro. The door just closed. The door just closed. Downstairs? No, it was literally... Bro, that door is closed. Number seven. That was open. We were literally in there a minute ago. That's you f***ing there. Rosie's room. Yo, oh, it just said Rosie, and I was like, no, we're in Anna's room. Look at the, the thing went, there was a door chuck, wasn't there? Look, nothing behind the door. That was from Anna's room. Look under the bed, just quick. Under the bed? Justin, I don't know. I don't know, like, what? Just a little girl in there, nothing here. I had right, nothing, right? I don't. Go over the edge. There's nobody there. Okay, holy shit. Did somebody fall in here though? Like, what was that? We might have to go find them, bro. That was absolutely insane. Here. Is it dead? Apparently. <sighs> My god. What the hell? No, no, no. I'm good, bro. Still works. Okay, so clearly there's some spiritual, like, activity up here right yeah. now. Yeah. Oh, my days. Oh. We've only investigated, like, 20% of this place so far. And this, like, the activity that we're supposed to get down in the morgue is supposed to, like, top this. I, I, oh my god. Alright, well, let's go back. Let's gather ourselves. Let's go get the rest of the equipment. Let's get the owner of this hotel. And let's go check out the rest of this place. I can't move right now. I literally cannot I'm Terrified. When I find the energy, I'm walking downstairs. I'm not coming back up here. Chris? Chris? What the? F oh my god! Yo! No idea what the hell that was. Yes, maybe. Okay, well. All right, well, let's just wrap this up. All right, we'll see you guys. Let's wrap this up and on stage. Hold on. Give me a camera for a sec. Drop it. Okay. Cool. Love that.
Wait, is that door? There's no f way. I literally just recorded the door. No, 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 no. I'm not going down there. Hell no. What? I'm not going down there. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'll put well, myself. You just said you you're you don't want to stay here. I'm not by myself. Well, you just said you don't want to stay here. Now you don't want to go down there. Dude, the door just closed. No, I don't want to go down there. That light just turned on. The motion detecting light? Yeah. So that means that there's motion detected down here. Mm -hmm. Get the f doors open. What do we do right now? Here, Seriously, what do we here. do right now, bro? We'll I have the we'll I don't fucking know what to do. Turn this off. Turn on again. Should I pull the fire alarm? <laughs> the fire alarm? Oh. Yeah, there's obviously some hot I shit going down. Don't... Oh my god. <laughs> They're not that. God, we can't. They're not down here right now? There's one way we can figure this out. Yeah. Whoa! What the <laughs> is Mole up there? That was the door again. I think he is up there. Yeah, yeah, you hear him, right? He's, he's literally just investigating up there. Yeah, yeah. Where were you? Outside. Okay. Bro. Things we're hearing. This door is open and closed. Twice already. What? Door in our room. The battery Close. fell out of your REM pod. What? Yeah. That door is open again. Alright, let's... I don't even know what to do right now. What do we do? I guess, um, let's go check this out quick. I'm gonna play. I swear I just heard a stray cat. A meow? Yeah. How do you know it's stray? Well, is there a cat here? I don't know. Okay guys, so we are about to do a seance in the seance room. We got everything set up right here. Let me just show you. This right here is a proximity sensor. And the closer you get, it changes colors. You get really, really close, goes to red, further away, yellow. And then obviously further from that is green. And we got a ton of cool equipment around us right now, but we're obviously back with the boys. And the reason we're doing this is obviously we're doing a seance. We want as much people as possible. And um, this is gonna be pretty interesting, so. Let's get ready. We're probably going to have the camera set up somewhere so we get everyone's angles and everyone's reactions and all the sorts. So let's get going. You have it? <laughs> Believe it or not, I've never done a seance before. Me neither. No, I have. Can we hold hands? Is that what yeah. we do? Is that what we're doing? Can we hold hands? You can do anything you want. We're, we're holding hands. We got to get closer then. We're, hold, we're holding hands. <laughs> hold my hands. Right. Chris is out of this. <laughs> <laughs> That's how I planned it. You can hold huh. feet. You just start, like, you see your ABCs right. backwards or something, right? My guy has opposable thumbs. <laughs> I like it. Do you just touch my dick? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah you just grab my ass. <laughs> All right, um, if there's anybody here, uh, you want to let us know? So this goes off by EMF. So, oh, that's cool. All right, so if that lights up, proximity yeah, sensor, a REM pod over there, REM pod on our haunted item. Uh, flashlight over here, flashlight over there, flashy ball, vibration, oh my uh, music box, mu uh, motion, so there's a bunch of trigger items around. That's what you like to hear. <laughs> Wait, are we actually holding hands? If you want. I mean, that's no, the, technically the best yeah, way to Really? Do okay, we're, we're, we're holding way. hands, guys. This is weird, I know, but it's we have to It's because I really it. want to hold your hands. Okay. Oh, All right. <laughs> Are there any spirits in here with us right now? Calling in the Shanley spirits. Calling in loved ones of our guests tonight. You're welcome to join us. Come sit at the table. We're here to talk to you, communicate with you. We're friendly. We mean no harm. And if you want to show yourself, feel free to show yourself. They're forming a circle of energy that you can use.
We come with good intent. Could have been anything. That's my husband, probably. Huh. No, it sounded like it came from behind Jessica. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, like where the mattresses. At first, okay. yeah, I heard that. Okay. If that was you, can you trigger something in the room? Can you turn on the flashlight? If you can turn on the flashlight, that would be great. Is that your shadow that I saw run by me in that room earlier? Oh God! Yeah, we. I said, oh, I seen a shadow when we were in the room. I saw a person upstairs. It startled me. Right before we came down the stairs, I didn't say anything, but I saw it. If that was you, can you meet, please make yourself a known? What if we gambled in here? They don't like gambling, right? Oh, they like gambling. Oh, they like gambling. Yeah. Do you want us to gamble in here? You want to have a drink with us? Two of us? Yep. Oh, flashlight. oh, the flashlight just went out all the way down there. That worked. Look at that. That's crazy. <laughs> that is wild. Wow. Okay, so they want to drink with us. Mm -hmm. They're going to want the whistles. What kind of drink do you want? Angela's got beer. Do you want me to run the machine? Let's do it. Let's yeah. do it for it. Let's actually have the machine, yeah. All right, this one I'm going to run first. There's two different... Completely different sounding, but they both run off of AM live radio. Okay. <clears throat> Look at the flashlight. It's like. Yeah, it's flickering a lot. And it just went out. As soon as you turn that on, it went out. Want a gin and tonic over there? Can we have that on the table? Yeah. Oh, I just turned a voice. Yeah. I don't know if you want it. Yeah, that's good. Oh, what is this thing? Geobox. Geobox 2. Was that you that turned on the flashlight? Is that too loud for you? What kind of drink would you like to have? He replied that right was away. a reply. Yeah. It's not like he said anything. Can you be more specific? I'll turn it down a little bit so it's not so echoey. What's your name? Last wow. minute, it kind of sounded like it said, "My name is," and then I couldn't make out the last part. How many people are stand are sitting here right now? Two thousand. We can hear you. Speak to us. What's my name? That noise is so creepy. It's very <laughs> I don't know if you know this. We can't see you. You can probably see us. But we can hear you.
Thank you for the responses you've been giving us. Can we have some more? Where are you right now? back there how come you haven't moved on why are you still here I don't know scared to scared to that's what it's scared, scared to what are you scared of what are you afraid of Do you feel anything? Lead. What did it say? Lead. What? Lead? Lead? Scared of lead. No, I said, do you feel anything? Are you feeling any pain right now? That's gonna make the room body walk. Ask it. Make the room call go on. Make to make this go Yeah. Ask it. Yeah. Ask what's in the box. What's in the box? Toothbrush? Toothbrush? <laughs> it sounded like dead body. That's why I heard. I heard dead body. Dead body? That's why I heard. Um, Which box are we talking about? There's a black case underneath the table. Oh. It's a haunted item. Okay. We don't let him out unless he tells you his name or what he is. Can you tell us what's in that black box? Or at least the name of what's inside the black box? Spirits of the Shanley do like what's in the box. Black box? That did sound it said, it said I hate him. Did it? Yeah, because uh, that's what I thought when I heard it. Why do you hate what's in the box? When you you're filming, right? So when you listen back, listen to that response. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. Yeah. Oh my god. Get me out of here. Get you out of where? I'd be more than happy to help. Getting good responses, it's hard to make out what they're yeah. saying. Last night I didn't get one voice from this machine, not one. Jeez. So insane. he is answering questions and there is a response to every pretty much every question you're talking about, which is kind of cool. See this one? Happy guys. Can you make that a little plastic ball light up on the couch? I really want to let what's in the box out of the box. Can you help us out? Can you give us a name and tell us what it is? It just said something about the box. Flashlight just turned off. Okay, I thought I heard his voice, his name in between that. Oh God. Can you repeat that name? I want to open the box, but you got to repeat the name. Nice and clear. Is 
for evil. That just spoke. Sometimes when you listen back and slow it down a little bit, it's easier. Woman's voice came up. Woman's voice again. Tell us what you are. Oh, that thing just went off behind you. Did it? Yeah. Oh, it is. It, it went up and down for a second. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah. What about that box on the chair over there that I'm pointing at? Can you make that go off? Come out? Come out. Did you hear something say come out? Something just said come out. Come out what come out of where? Searching for a way out of the box? It sounds like someone's like walking through the. How many guests are in here tonight? How many of the boys? How many boys? That female's voice said go away. Say six? I heard six. Scream if you need help. What's in the box? See the guy? Something about a guy. What I thought it said, Something about a guy. see the guy? I don't. I don't see a guy. <laughs> what guy are you talking about? Where is he? Box. What about the box? I heard it. Outside the box or in the box? That dark, dark, the, the deeper voice at the end. 
fell in, the in the water. That's what I heard. Oh, oh flashlight went off again. I saw you turn the flashlight on. Who was that? What's your name? It's flickering. It was for a second. It's me. It's me. Okay, thank you for doing that. That's so nice of you. But like, can we get a name? Why don't you guys introduce yourselves formally? Get a little bit more comfortable and introduce ourselves. My name is Mo Sarji. My name is Angelo. My name is Yasko. We would like to meet you. What's your name? As soon as you said Yasko, I heard get out. Maybe you should share your name. My name is Chris. I'm just the camera guy. And you probably know who Kelly is. She probably doesn't need an introduction, right? yourself in the mirror. Let's try a different box. Don't go away. It just sounded like there was like footsteps and then like a real so Imagine like an empty hallway. They create that to do that in the box? No, it? it's uh it's like noise pull <coughs> gates and just it sounds creepy. It's very creepy. It sounds like something they use at Guantanamo Bay. <laughs> so this is um, another one that scans off at AM. This is the one I was reading out um, in the room out there, but... Oh, that's him. That was me, that was me. We're just testing, huh? testing the REM that's Oh, that's him. Oh. So we have a device that you can communicate to us clearly on. Hi. Hi. Yep. Is that weird? It's the same noise. Different machine, but same noises. It's crazy. It wasn't doing that out in the other room. No, it wasn't doing that earlier. That no. noise. Yeah. Jeez. Hello. Who's here with us? Ooh. Ooh. Wow. Ed. Did you just hear Ed? I heard, I heard Ed. Ed. I heard Ed, yeah. Ed. Hey, Ed, Ed, how are you? Ed. Trying to breathe? Trying to breathe. Trying to breathe? Why are you trying to breathe? Where are you? All right, last night we got down in the basement. I can't breathe. Wow. <laughs> Why can't you breathe? What happened to you? I heard, huh? I heard Ed again. There's so many different voices. Yeah, yeah there's about three or four right now. Well, somebody strangled or suffocated here. We can hear you guys, but not too clearly. Brandon? Burned? That was a creepy voice. Yeah. Burned? That was so weird. That was three or four words. That voice sounded like more dominant than all yeah. of them. Scared. There it is again. Scared? The same voice. Scared. Scared. Why are you scared? What's scary?
Greed or Fred? Greed? Can you tell us what's in the black box? <laughs> did you say demon? Yes, he just yeah. did. That was clear. That There's was a one. demon in the black box. What's the demon's name? Keep in mind, guys, I don't even know what the demon's name is. That's in the box. None of us, none of us, except. Can you tell us the demon's name? Please. Thank you. Adam? Give us a letter. Demon is it? Scary. Scary. Scary demon. A scary demon in the box. Inside this black box. There is a black box under the table that has a scary demon inside of it. Should we open the box? I really want to open this box. Can't and something else said no. Why can't we open the box? It just said Kelly. There's a whole bunch of other things. It's not like I said it's coming. Oh. Who's coming? <laughs> Something said hello. Hello, who is this? What if I open the box without getting the name first? What's gonna happen? I don't know. That was like some. Yeah. That was four or five weird. words. Same voice. Do you know how fast that's scanning through AM station? That yeah. you should not get four or five words, same voice like that, that strong. Jeez, okay. I have no. I have recorded that. I don't know what he said. I'm gonna open the box whether whether I'm allowed to or not. Is anything bad gonna happen? Die. It was like don't. But you haven't told me why I can't. Sleeping here tonight. I can't leave. Okay. Did you just? I. I heard death box. I don't know if you guys heard that. Okay. That's kind of what I heard. Okay. Now he has said that means he has said his name. 
His name is Death Box? Death. Death? Is your name Death? Obviously. Obviously. Oh my Holy god. god. <laughs> wow. Well. Okay. His name. Whoa. He named himself. Guys. He named himself. We said we're not going to call it because the item in the box is the thing. Yeah. And, and I said, well, we're not going to call you that anymore. What do you want to be called? And he says, Mort. Mort? Morty. Morty. Just Which Mortem. Means death. death. Yeah. Uh, Muerte. In Spanish. Well, Italian. Yeah. Latin. Mortal. Latin. All right, Death, we're going to open your box up. All right, who's doing the honors? I don't touch him, so I will open the box, but if you want him out, you will take him out. I'll take him out. Go for it. Let's keep this thing running while we take him out of the box. Absolutely. Yeah. I'm just going to move this rampart over. So just to let you guys know that this box here has something very evil. There's a demon. And uh, we're going to... All right, here we go. Oh, what Ooh. the hell? Wow, you hear that? Uh -huh. As soon as we open that? What's your name? Besides death, real name. It just said, I could have sworn it said touch it. You guys want to touch it? You can touch it. We're touching you. Can't take it out. Mm -hmm. Just don't break them, because oh. I don't want a thousand warts around. <laughs> <laughs> Baby warts. <laughs> you know my name? Yeah, I heard, hands off that. I heard that too. What did you say? They're like, it's take your hands off hands that. Off that. Go ahead, Andrew. Do you not like it when we touch it? That thing's terrifying. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Spirits of the family. What is he? You know he replied yes to you when you said that, right? What type of demon is he? I just want to dead body to see if we're out there. Say yes, go. Say it. Answer me. Okay. Yeah, you guys have any questions? Ha. Say your name, or I'm putting you back in and closing you up. Are you causing pain to all the spirits that are in here right now? Oh, oh, you might be doing Behind me. the proximity sensor at all. Yeah. That just turned off. But you're too far away from that. Yeah, you're yeah. really far. That's him, yeah. You have to get really close. Yeah, it's not doing anything. Die. It's not even, yeah, it's not even doing anything at all. Okay. Death. Oh, what is that? What? What is that? What do you see? It just came out of that. That was orb. Just came out of that. Flew towards us. Back down that way. Then back this way. And then landed on that couch. I got that on camera. It was really significant. Can you make that ball light up on the couch? Morty. Morty. Oh my Morty. God. There we go. Yo, Morty. What's up, man? Was that that, you? Was, that was that was clear. Do we know like the significance of like where this came from? Um, my friend purchased. Actually, he went to purchase a haunted item. Um, the guy who met him said just take it. Mm -hmm. Um, he was causing troubles in his house, and um, my medium friend had it for a while, and this it started what? causing him trouble. It's bad. It just went green. And um. He said, would you like it at the Shanley? And I said, okay. Hmm. Interesting. So should that be doing that going green like that? I don't know. I just went over to it and it was not doing anything. It's not, this was yeah. really right in front of it. It was not too long. Yeah. How did the demon get stuck in this clown object, whatever it is? Wow, that's quiet. That's what that sounded. Would you like me to put some holy water in there with you? Wait. 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 Wait.
Do you want me to put you back in the box? Feel that cold wind right and now. And close it up. I, just, right I can feel my hoodie on. I, I just felt a cold breeze over here. Absolutely. Right into you. You just started now. I wasn't yeah. doing it before. I'm feeling like right here. We're on the spot right now. We have similar functions. Hey, Morty. I heard Morty very faintly again. Yeah, Morty, and then what? Yeah, that's crazy. Yeah, that's AM station. It's playing through. All right, Morty. Well, we're gonna put you back in the box and lock you up, okay? Out. It wants to stay out. Now we're gonna put you back in. We're gonna put you back in, okay? You well, that just went off again. Yeah. I saw it go off just now in the box. It was orange. It's, so it's very strange when you were holding it, a, a really distinct orb came out of that, and the way it flew, it's like it was controlling its flight path, and then it and just it disappeared over there by that box. All right, well, I'm gonna put. Oh! Oh! oh. oh okay! By the dog. That's what oh, you said. Oh! Yeah, said that. Hey, Morty! You know what's funny? Guys, the flashlight. The flashlight. The flashlight. Oh my gosh. And you know what's funny? I said, I said, we're gonna put you back in the box unless you give us something. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, oh, there it is oh again. my god. See, he's scared to go back in the box. I'm getting like cold chills. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. yeah. Are, you, are you scared to go back in the box? It's still this going, look at the it. The flashlight as well. He doesn't want to go back in the box. He does not want to go back in the box. Can you make that box on the couch turn on? If you can make that box turn on, I will not put you back in the box. Oh my gosh. This is wild. we're getting no voices. No voices. Yeah. No so voices. And just this one crazy. Oh, is that? Do you want to, do you want to stay out? It's like yelling. Yeah, something is yelling. Yeah, it's like getting angry. Guys, take a no. flashlight on. That's crazy. Flashlight's out. Dog's flashlight's out. out now. Oh my gosh. What about those other ones over there? Who's touching the dog? This is insane. The dog's an EMF. We're getting some great evidence right now, guys. The dog is a uh, uh, REM pod. Oh, okay. Yeah, chills right now. So if there's anything interfering with this... Because I'm holding this thing. <laughs> Morty, are you touching the dog? Morty, I guess we're going to put you back in the box. You're not giving us enough. Oh, it's like it's what? answering you every yeah. time. Yeah, he's pissed. He's pissed because he doesn't want to go back in the box. Why don't you want to go back in the box? <laughs> every time. Yeah. Every time. Stay. Stay. Okay. Wants to stay out. Yeah. Can you make that other box go off? That's crazy. This yeah. is so crazy. If you can make that other box go off, then that'd be awesome. And I won't put you back in the box. I'm gonna t stop this for a second. Okay. So that, lock, so that dog should not be going off. That dog's a sensor. Yeah, that's a sensor. Huh? It's crazy. The only time this dog has gone off sorry, is sorry, sorry. That's it, that's it. up in Rosie's bed. That's the only time oh, wait. it's ever gone off? Maybe it wasn't me. How long have you had that dog for? Uh, I just got that dog uh, a couple weeks ago. Okay. And the only time it's gone off is in Rosie's bed. How long ago was that? A week ago. About a week ago. Yeah. Then, so okay. it took a week for that to go off again? And you know why he's going off? Because he's mad. He's gonna go back in the box. Yeah. All right, Mort, I'm putting you back in the box, okay? Make that go off again, and we won't, we won't put you in the box. Oh, it's, it's off, off right now. Yeah. Okay. Because I flashlight's going off again. Oh my god. Oh yeah. Flashlight's on. It's going off. Okay. All right, Mort, I'm putting you back in the box, okay? Unless you give us some evidence, unless you turn the flashlight on or quiet. Dead quiet. Make the dog go off and we won't put you in the box. A deal's a deal. That's so creepy. Yeah, oh my gosh. Yeah. It's like a, a scream. He's it sounds mad. like a scream. Yeah. Like a you don't have to be mad. You can be okay and give us information and talk to us. We're not getting any voices now. Why is that? Yeah, they're gone. Are you suppressing everybody's voice? I think that the other spirits had scared. Jazz, go. Let me see that. Absolutely. Uh, oh, flashlight just right. went off. I don't think they're gone. I feel really good. Really All right, man. You're going back in the box. See you later. Okay. Okay. Flashlight's on really bright. That's really, really bright. bright. Listen, listen, listen. Voices are starting to come back now. As I put them in the box, voices are coming back. 
Are you happy we're putting them back in the box? I scream every time you ask something. Mm -hmm. Spirits of the Shanley, we're starting to hear your voices again. You want him in the box. Yeah. See, the voices yes. are coming back now. I heard, yeah. They want him in the box. Spirits of the Shanley, do you want us to lock him up? Put him away. All right, demon. You can go back in your box now. Close it. Evil. 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 Close it. Close it. Yep. Do I do the honors? Okay. Do it. That was clear. Do it. That was a woman saying evil. Yeah. I noticed voices are starting to come back now. Yeah. Holy crap. That was some crazy evidence. Yeah, very, very crazy. That was that was a woman saying evil. Spirits of the Shelly, are you back with us? I will play you something later on. I can play it for you now if you don't mind. Yeah, no problem at all. Spirits of the Shelly, are you back? But you know what's crazy? Remember how the REM pod was going off? Yeah. I thought it was me going off, but look how close her arm is to it. Yeah. yeah. That was That's true. So it was not me. So that REM pod has four settings and it should be on the first one, which means you have to literally basically touch the antenna yeah. for it to go off. Look at that. So you that was going off by itself. I was holding it like this. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It He does set off REM pods quite yeah. often. That's why I set it, the REM pod on top of his box, because mm -hmm. some nights we'll say, do you want out? And mm -hmm. he'll set the REM pod off. And before we continue, please do not attach yourselves to any yeah. of us. Morty, thank you for talking to us. Uh, thank you. Yeah. Making that go off. And then we put it back in, but he didn't want to be like that. <laughs> <laughs> he was literally putting up the mic, guys. You know that, right? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, so I'm going to play for you uh, what one of our spirits had said through the geo box. Hey, Esther, do you like what's in the box? Oh, my gosh. It's just, I hate him. Clear as day. I hate hey, him. Hey, Esther, do you like what's oh, in that the shows. box? That shows. I hate him. I hate him. So they're not real keen on him. No, I don't blame them. She, I'm going to yeah. listen back later on, guys, when yeah. you are around, walking around, because I heard, thought I heard a couple responses that I don't want to assume until i listen back but i yeah, thought i heard a couple absolutely. of responses yeah. if you guys caught anything that we missed as well in that whole seance and the whole conversation there please let me know down in the comment section below because that was that was probably the craziest interaction i've ever had with the other side for sure mm. um so we could do a couple other things in here uh we have um the headphones and the estes experiment i don't know if you want to try that i would love to i've always that? wanted to do that the spirit box yeah Thank with the yeah. headphones so if you don't mind i would love to do that okay everybody now we're gonna go into somewhere that not a lot of people get access to not a lot of people have footage from down here and it has a very very dark background we're going we're going down into the basement and basically the basement was a morgue at one point and it's scary to think about because there was a lot of bodies that were down there. They kept them down there during the winter time. I'm not exactly sure why. I don't know the whole story behind that, but yeah, I'm going to be doing something very crazy down there. Something I'm like, I'm like shaking right now. I don't know if you can see the camera shake a little bit. My, I'm actually scared to do this, but let's go down there and let's go take a look at what we got going on. Sheesh. Jamie, are you down here? Huh? I have a machine running here. It's our phasma box. You got set up. So what did you say this was down here again? This is um that's the portal area where, and then this is our morgue over this way oh so that's the morgue over that's there that's the morgue over here oh days oh my days oh okay, my days oh wow yeah that one was not Amy, is that you this is the morgue oh my gosh jamie if that was you can you do that again So 
so this was the morgue. Yeah, this is really creepy. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. Ooh, it's hard to breathe in here. Yeah. My, my chest is so tight. Is it? Yeah. Oh, spirit. This is so creepy. Is there anybody in here? If there's anybody in here, can you please make some sort of sound? Some sort of... I don't know, give us a sign. Anything at all. Jeez, look at that. Feel free to uh, touch us. Grab Biasco's butt. Yeah, please don't do that. For the love of God. <laughs> you wanna go take a seat? Mm -hmm. Oh, there you mean? Yeah. I mean, whatever. Alrighty. Oh, look, there's like a little ball down here. No, here's That's pretty right. cool. That's creepy. Okay. Okay. So Angelo is sitting in a chair inside of the morgue right now. You want to ask any sorts of questions, Angelo? Um, yeah. Is there anybody here with me? Oh, yeah. Well, I can hear the REM pod going off. Again. That's what crazy. Is that a REM pod as well? That is um, static dome. So, uh, I want to see what's going on. Yeah, let's go <laughs> check that out. <laughs> Oh, Sorry. Nothing's going off right now on its own. Oh my days. The static dome's coming off. The morgue is creepy. Hey, that? That's oh, gosh. Gotcha. Yeah, static dome. What does that do? It makes noises. Yeah. It, there's no noise. It just uh, does uh, it detects static. Detects static. Uh, okay. So. Uh, that didn't go off at all when we were up in the uh, other room. What was his name? Charlie? Charlie, and we have little Jamie. Charlie, you're Jamie. That sounds like young. Where Jamie's are you guys? Six. That sounds like a kid that came through. Oh. Seriously. That like Jamie! What if I go and I, what, my agreement with Jamie is he, he turns the flashlight on when we ask. Yeah. I always clap for him. Alright, Jamie, you want to turn on the flashlight? Whoa, what did I just say? Where's Scott? Okay. Scott. My medium friend. Oh. Oh gosh. Where is Scott? Scott's not here right Scott's now. Scott's not here. That's Oh my god. Whoa. Oh, the light just turned on. Well, oh, about that. yay, Jamie! The turned on and the temperature Jamie. decreased. Thanks, Jamie. Oh, wow. That is a lot of activity. So I'm number 12. Hmm. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, shit. Yeah. So you just turned off my light. Actually. Really? Actually. I, this is a brand new light. I haven't used it all night. Is it on? It's on. Something just turned off my light. And the K2 something was going off on crazy. Something turned on that light. Flashlight. There we go. Oh, we got motion. Oh. Oh. Thank you, Jamie. Passing right through the REM pod. This is the K2. Put us in the cage. Put us in the cage. I have no idea what that is. <laughs> what was that? That was the most terrifying thing. Yeah. Dude, that just gave me chills on my entire body. Right. Oh my god. Something walked yeah, right past there. Yeah. And then it said Jamie. that. Who is that? Whose voice was that? Put us in the cage. What does that mean? Is that like another word for like the morgue? It said put Jamie. us in the cage. Is it, it put us in a cage or something? Maybe like yeah. another word for more, but we're like we're in the basement where the morgue is. I don't know. All right, I'm gonna turn this off. All you right. guys want me to so, turn it off or leave it on? Whatever Let's works for you. I, I say we take it inside the morgue. Area. Yeah, you guys go ahead and do that. We're gonna do this portal. So here's what we're about to do. There's this little hallway to literally nowhere over here, and what this is is a portal to the other side. Now, what I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna go in there and I'm gonna try this one more time. I'm gonna put these headphones on. I'm gonna have Chris ask me questions and we'll just see like if I'm able to explain you what I'm hearing and some answers to your questions. So let's go ahead and do this. Tell you what, stick around. Maybe she can help me ask questions to Jay as well. He's got the, uh, he's gonna have the headphones on and he's gonna ask some, we're asking some questions. How are you feeling? Oh. I'm all right, my head feels a little light right now. Does it? Yeah, we'll make it. Kind of normal for okay. that area. 
Sounds good. As far as the energies. Can you just hold this for one second for me over this tripod? Sorry, I just cannot see you right now. Thank you. Just a little bit of a tight space. I think oh, that's a it. turn. That's why. All right. Good? Yep. Just let me know whenever you're ready. Go ahead. You're officially ready? Yeah. Do you want to be in position two or are you just going to ask questions like that? Let's ask questions like this. It's fine. Okay. Already, already, well, I'm in position right now inside of this tunnel and um, I'm in this hallway. Now, here's what I'm going to do. I'm gonna put these headphones on. I'm gonna have Chris and Kelly ask questions, and I'm just gonna say exactly what's coming through here. I'm not. I can't hear what you guys are gonna be saying once I have these on. This is really, really loud, and um, I have to actually talk loud because I hear it from my neck where it is. So, I already my lights feeling like lightheaded in here. I guess it's kind of normal. It's kind of a little tight area. Look, it's just a hallway to nowhere. It's creepy. Well, you guys ready? We're ready. All right, ready. I just have a door. Oh, you closed? Yeah, I closed. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> we do have a run pod below us, too, so. All right. Um, so who's here with us right now? One. <laughs> uh oh. What does that mean? Um, they have numbers, some oh. of these people, uh, and okay. number one would be, like, the, the head one. All right. Are you mad that Jazz is in the portal right now? That's our hot water here. Ah, jeez. What? It's like a re really, really high-pitched ringing that came through here. I don't know if it's like... Let's make sure this connected, right? Oh, well, we asked the question and it answered perfectly, so... Sick, all right. I'm just gonna make sure this connected perfectly. That hurt really bad. Just do one here if you have to. Keep one ear off a little bit. No, I can't hear your questions. Sure. Okay, ready. Is this your majesty? Angry. <laughs> Burn. Ooh. Sorry. That's creepy. Can you let Jazz know what you're feeling right now? Touch him if you want to touch him. Touch his knee. Get out. Okay. Yeah. Get out of where? Which demon are you? Do you want us to leave? Free me from what? Are you stuck in here? That feels good. Okay. We told him to touch him. We did, yeah. You're right. You have a name? There's a little red light down here. If you want to interact with us, you can touch this little red light. Make it light up. Make it make noise. Off. <laughs> off again. We're not turning it off. Can you turn it off? Do Alone? Want, do you want the lights off? I think that's what they mean. Lights off? Yeah. Turn down a little. Is that better? I've heard off like 30 times. Like off, off, off. Alright, you wish it was What are you doing? Oh, that's what it wants the lights off. It wants the lights off. Oh, okay. Okay, I'm putting these back on. <laughs> sure, go for it. Send it. All right, we just turned the light off. Is that what you wanted? Stay. Yeah, is that good? Ooh, touch, just, just touch him. Yeah, touch him on the knee. To let him know that you're in there with him. Touch Jessica. You don't have to hurt him. Just Behind you. Mm -hmm. oh. Do you know how many times we get in the earth behind you? Really? Yeah. Turn. That's wild. Turn around, Jessica. He can't hear me. He can't. Make Jasco turn around. Tap him yeah. on the shoulder or something. Let him know you're there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What the hell is that? What? Is that on? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. I feel like some cold came behind me. Uh, we just told him to tap him on the shoulder behind you. 
Oh. We, we, told, uh, we told him to tap you on the shoulder. Let him know you're here. You. Oh gosh, it was like the coldest we, feeling on my neck. We literally told him to let you know that you're there. I feel like someone kissed me on my neck. <laughs> it was like, it was the softest touch, but it was like so cold. Yeah, we oh. told him to touch you. Thanks. You're welcome. Thank you for communicating with us. We do appreciate that. Oh. If, there, if there's anything you want to tell us, send it through his ears. Let him know. Play through the speakers. Do you want the lights off again? Divine. Divine. Do you believe in God? I just heard you're pushing it. You were pushing it. Holy cow. Wait till he hears what I asked. <laughs> Do you want the lights off? Do you believe in God? No. Oh my God. He, there's no way, and, and I'm telling everybody as we're filming, there is no way he's hearing these questions. It's way too loud. He definitely cannot hear us. Can you make this little pod light up in front of us or maybe just touch Jasko again? Let him know you're in there. Control. You're not going to control any of us. Not us. Do you want control of this basement? Get out. Of course you do. That was clear. What? Oh, shoot. That's here. Alone. You want us to leave? Do you want us to go? Yo, come ask some questions to Yasko. Or to... What's happening? So he's got this headphones on. Ask some questions. Do we get good responses really to our questions? Incredible. Just anything. Absolutely. How, how big is this portal? Or how old is it? Sixty? What is sixty or six hundred? Oh Can you say God. that again? No. No way. Heard six something. I can't tell if it's sixty or six hundred. How old is this portal? Oh yeah. Yeah, I don't want to hear what we're saying. You don't want to hear what I'm saying. Charles? Charlie's the ghost that's down here. Did it actually just say yeah. Charlie? Well, I asked how old the portal is. Yeah, 600. And it said 600 or so so Charlie, do you want us to turn the lights off again? We can turn the lights we can, off. We can make it darker. Two. Two? What's two? Two lights. Oh, that's true. Two lights are on? Okay, you want to turn, turn them off. Turn them off. Are off. All right, we're in the dark, Charlie. This is what you wanted? Please? Tall. He is tall, right? Yeah. He's tall, eight feet. Eight feet, seven Let Yasko know that you're here, please. Do something. How tall are you? Taking some light photos. Ah, fuck. What? Stop. Stop, Stop. Stop. doing that, bro. Oh, oh, oh. oh. You got something ah, on fuck. Yeah, what happened? Bro, that's the most piercing sound ever that comes through here sometimes. Oh my god, you guys hear that laugh? Yeah. Man? I told him to let him know that you were here again. Oh, thanks. I just. Ah, oh, jeez, that hurts so bad. Oh. It's like a really, like peer, like a dog whistle, you know, like a little dog whistle. Yeah, absolutely. Really, really high pitched. Do you have anything in there that's got red on? The what? Oh, the red yeah, light. Yeah. Okay, the SP7. Okay, it's got a red light. I'm gonna try like I a couple night photos. I'm gonna oh. try a couple more minutes. We'll see how this goes. Let's go back, like talk, and take some more night photos. Let's do it. How did this portal get here? Who opened it? Divine. The second time we heard that. Divine again. Who's saying hello? I'm gonna ask oh again. God. Do you believe in God? Close it. Does it hate you? Do you believe in God? Laugh. Who's laughing? He's laughing on our question. You know, God is the Almighty. He's more muddier than you are. So why laugh at him? Good is more powerful than bad. God has already won. You can't win against God. Win. Win? I said win. 
I said you can't win against Bob. Yeah, you can't win against Bob. And he said win. Seven. Okay, that's another number. Seven. That's the second time that hello voice. Seven again. I'm just saying. Seven times seven. That's three sevens. Three like, sevens in a row? Three sevens like in a row. Angels? Maybe. Um, yeah. Five, yeah. Five, five, five is the is man, six, six, six is the devil, and seven is angel again. Yeah, seven, 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 what's that? Angels? I believe so, yeah. Get out. Well, that's not the you want us to leave? Turn around. Okay. Stay. Do you want me to turn around or stay? What do you want me to do? Do you want us to leave? And Jack's go to stay? I'm gonna take some flash photos. Why? Yeah. Yeah. So yes. Oh no. Again. He wants us to leave? Yeah, he wants Jasko's. us to leave and Jasko to stay. If we leave, are you gonna do something to Jasko? Because that would be awesome. Where's, how do I open my flash? Death. Wow. Oh, that was so clear. No, no, <laughs> no. That was so That's clear. Death. He, has no clue he doesn't know what we're asking. He doesn't know what we're even asking. He is not going to be happy. Why do you want to hurt Yasko? What did he do? Cold. Is he cold? Tell us your name. I just heard we are sinners. Like, oh, we are God. sinners. That was cool. Do you want us to pray for you? Yes. Help. Oh my god. Wow. How is he? That's incredible. Are you, st are you stuck in purgatory? We can we can pray. Okay. Oh. This run pause is going on. It's literally right in front of us. It's getting really cold. Now. It is. I'm going to take this camera off. Oh, oh, oh my god. What's going on in there? Oh. I don't know whether to turn the lights off. What happened? Oh, it was so cold. It felt like like something like grabbed me like this behind my leg, just like, just like ran it like this. Yeah. Oh my god! I literally can't move right now. I cannot wait for you to watch this back I and listen. Yeah. You have no when idea. You hear the questions we answered were every question. You're you lying. have no idea what you were, you were asking. We were that's you wait. Oh, it's scary. It's very. Scary. I want to talk. Uh, <laughs> I'm like tearing up right now. Holy shit. Um, do you want Yasko to leave or do you want him to stay in there with you? Oh gosh, okay. Make this go do green you if you want mind, him to stay. Um, if we say a prayer. Uh, okay. We can say a prayer. I think I'm. I think that that last touch was enough. I can't even. Like, hmm. I can't do. Does this. anybody else want to try? Yeah, I mean, yeah. Are we leaving the cameras on for that? Or? Huh? I'll cameras on for the prayer. Or or cameras on. Oh my gosh, my whole body just chills right now. So, uh, you said you had a crazy story about the last time you were here? Yeah, and I actually don't think I ever told anyone this story <sighs> except the owner, and she can vouch for me because this was, this was a total like mind, like mind fuck, mm -hmm. if you will. So, what happened was. We came in together, and like I said, I came with a group first. It was me, my girlfriend, and three of my friends who refused to ever film with me again mm -hmm. because of last time. They said that they had the most terrifying experience here, but that's not what this is about. We came in and we all signed our waivers. And when it came time to uh, like get ready and stuff, I realized that I forgot something in the car. So I went back out to the car and it was getting dark. Like the sun was just about set. So it had like a little blue tint to it still and from where the parking area is over there i looked to the right and i saw a little girl silhouette of like a little girl giggling and laughing like behind the building you know and i was like okay went back inside and everyone's like staring at me because I, I obviously felt like i just i was like what the hell's going on so i asked kelly the owner and i was like hey um there's some like kids in the backyard, you know, like so is this something that we should be like concerned about or, you know, is, where are their parents? Are these your kids? Like, I, I don't know. I just saw kids running in the backyard mm -hmm. and uh, she goes, um, I'm pretty well known in this neighborhood and I'm pretty sure that there's no kids on this neighborhood. 
She goes, where did you see this kid? And I said, I saw it literally right back there in the backyard area when I was at the car. And she was so mind fucked because what she said was that, that there used to be a well back there where a little girl fell into and died. Wow. It's insane. Yeah. <laughs> That's honestly insane. So. And the thing is, like, as soon as she told me that, my girlfriend refused to, like, even stay in this building. Like, she, she was so scared she left the building. And it, from then on, it was just wild. Mm -hmm. That's how it started for me. I, I really, like, I haven't told many people that story. And I guess mm. the question arises, I, I think I finally built up. It's been quite a while now. I kind of want to go back out there and see if I could get in contact with that little girl. Yeah. Because from what Kelly told me is that they don't show themselves to just anybody. They have to really trust you. Mm -hmm. And I feel like, her showing her body apparition, her silhouette, if you will, to me was like a sign of trust, as if she, like she wants to contact me. So I think that, you know, maybe if we go out there with some type of, I don't know, I don't know how you guys want to do this, but with something. You and said try a to get well? Contact. So we yeah, don't know well. where it's, hmm. do we know where it's marked? Or? I actually don't know. I mean, we you could go in an area where I saw her run around. You think what I'm thinking? What? Thousand rounds? Yeah, that's a good idea. I mean, if we don't know the exact spot, yeah, like water and yeah. electricity, I mean, that, that would make sense. Yeah. All right. Let's give it a shot then. Let's go head out there and uh, let's go see if we could figure out where this well is and as well as like what's going on in the well. Cool. So, okay. Uh, so many to choose from. Which ones do I pick? I don't know, man. Those green ones look pretty fancy. <laughs> they do look <laughs> kind of cool. I'm gonna go with these. Cool. So do you want to ask the questions in here or outside? Oh, um, right. I guess outside would make the most sense. It's gonna do it's like for you, sorry, right? Grabbing pistols when you go took an AK-47. Look at those things. Why are you filming that? <laughs> <laughs> Chandelier moved and no one did it. Okay. So we are outside right now and let's go actually all right so i'm gonna take you guys to the exact area i'm gonna give you like a full replay as of what happened when i saw the figure of this little girl now my car is parked in the exact same spot that it was last time so this is what happened went over here and i had something in my trunk so i went to go get it went right here Open my trunk, got what I needed, closed my trunk, and I hear like a giggling in this direction over here. And all I see is a silhouette of a little girl run from right to left and disappeared behind the building back there. Oh wow. So maybe we should go check this out together. I don't see insane. I don't make any assumptions, but is that... Uh, I think that's just covering... To be honest. Okay. I mean, it could be anywhere, honestly. Yeah. Why is that light on up there? Weren't all the lights off upstairs? Uh, I, I mean, I could be wrong, but I thought all the lights were off. Honestly, I'm pretty sure I turned the lights off on that room. Well, that's terrifying, yeah. though. Yeah, yeah. Are the blinds dude, down, too? Dude, the lights in that room literally turn themselves on. I went in and I'm like, oh, who the hell left the lights on? I turned the lights off. That's me. <laughs> came nah, back downstairs. I'm good on that. Right, cool. Not for me. Yeah. What right, the I'm going to be honest, guys. Yeah. Oh. Is that it? Yo, it's got to be, right? You think? Yeah, absolutely. It has to be. What was that? You heard that, too? Yeah. All right, well. Ask away. I'm going to. Yeah. Okay. Considering there's caution tape right there and Yeah, yeah. Here we go. Uh we could take turns asking questions, so by all means here we go. I mean you can have to with her, so you wanna ask the first question. Okay. The spirit of the girl of the 
the girl that I saw over a year ago, do you remember me? Oh. Okay. I'm guessing it's yes. Normally when they cross it's yes, right? I think so. Okay. I, that's what we... I'll I mean, clarify from now on. We've done that in the past, say, though. Yeah. yeah. From now on forward, when I ask a question with these dowsing rods, cross for yes, open up for no. Did you trust me that day? Is that why you showed yourself to me? Okay, well, they crossed again, so... That's... That's a good sign. Yeah, absolutely. Let's find out if this is the right spot. If you saw a child, it's probably not going to be evil, like bad energy, right? It's just going to be... Yeah, but more sometimes... Some demons like to pretend to be children, because that's how the <laughs> demon will get the living to trust them. Right? <laughs> Alright, so, never mind, I mean, forget anything. But, I mean, there is historical evidence that a girl died here in a well, so... Sweet, cool. The likelihood of it being just a normal little girl is probably high. Okay, yeah. Thanks for that. Was your death an accident? Oh my god. Guys? Those are spreading. That's a no. It's like barely doing so. I mean, I'm, I know I'm shaking just a little bit. It's obviously, it's like 40 degrees right now. But, um, they're opening up. They're literally opening. So her death wasn't an accident. From what I'm getting here. That's insane, bro. Oh god, okay, I'm gonna ask, ask, ask your name or we can't. We can't. Uh, can't. Shit, shit, shit. All right, cool. We got that too. Yeah. Do you need help crossing to the other side? Mm. Nothing. Like I'm shaking right now. It's not doing anything. Yeah. Once again, I'm shaking because I'm cold. So. So, if they don't want help to go to the other side, maybe they're, like, happy where they are, I guess? Yeah. Could be, yeah. Could be or they don't want to answer because the latter, like we said, yeah. it is someone manipulating us right now. Yeah. I mean, it is a little girl. Maybe they don't know that there is an other side. I think about She's so girl, young. Right? Maybe they're, they're a little really girl. Maybe they that. didn't <laughs> know too much. Depends how little they are. We don't know yeah. that information either. From what I saw, it was probably about, like, waist height. Mm -hmm. For, like, my waist. Mm -hmm. So, I saw long hair. Ooh, what other That's questions so can creepy. I ask? I mean, yes or no questions. So, like, um, I asked her, like, if she's scared of us or if she's happy where she's at. I don't know. Okay. Ask if, she, ask if she's a demon. There's a better question I could ask, actually. Shoot. Which aligns to that. You ready? Before or where you are at now, did you used to be a human? No. Yes. Okay. So no demon. Demons were never human, which is a good sign. So maybe this is just like a trapped spear. I'm telling you. Could be, yeah. They clearly trust me for whatever reason. I don't know why they trust me. Yeah, poor judgment on their part. For <laughs> poor sure. judgment of character. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, geez, I'm, Getting the heebies right now. I guess um This is wild. This is a cool spot. It's totally interesting. Yeah. What did you see? What? I saw like a person back. See, I saw someone move up there earlier, but I didn't yeah, that's the, the little balcony thing. Yeah. Yeah. Not the, no, that's the balcony. Yeah. Sorry, it's the right of the, right. the window? You know what's crazy? I think that's the window where me and Chris, when we first started here, like the first 10 minutes, yeah. a ball rolled into the room. Really? Oh, that was so terrible. Oh my God, yeah, it was. Ooh. Okay, I guess I'm gonna, I'm gonna end this on a high note. I, I'm really grateful for you trusting me, and I'm very, very grateful for you giving me the opportunity to speak to you. I'm sorry I didn't get back to you over a year ago when I was here last time. I, I honestly was just scared, but I finally Ooh. built up the courage. Yo. Oh, what the f- Oh my god. What the sorry, scared sorry. me too. Sorry. Yo, oh. I just had the worst and craziest experience ever with that mirror. And that's what happened? I was looking into the mirror, and then it's like, it's like my face changed. 
It's like a demon. Like a demon was in my face. What did I tell you? What? I just had a crazy experience in there earlier. Dude, I was looking at myself. I closed my eyes for 30 seconds and I asked it to show themselves to me. When I opened my eyes, it was my face, but it was like smiling. I was straight face like this. Like Axel? On my life. Bro, so on what everything I love. What happened with me is I had the spirit box, that big one, and it was just going off. It was giving me lots of voices, lots of things. Oh. So much was happening on it. And then I just froze. And it's like, I wanted to take my eyes off the mirror, but it, my, my eyes were like glued, completely glued to it. And then all of a sudden my face just started changing. It was like cracking up, but it was turning demonic at the same time. Like it didn't look like me. I didn't recognize myself. And I freaked out and I ran the hell out of there. I don't know. That's and wild. He, he's saying he, that, like she told us, she told us that mirror, yeah, it's, it's like a black mirror. It's what it called, it's called a black mirror. It's like, it's like a gateway or a portal. And it shows you if something's attached to you or if something is in the premises. I definitely have something attached to me. That's, we all know that. That's fucked up. Well, I got the answers I needed outside, and I before I leave, I just want to say thank you, and I'm sorry for what happened to you. And, Wait, what uh, happened? So, I came here over a year ago, and it's a really, really sad story, but we came in, I came with my girlfriend and three of my friends. All of them, after this, they never want to come back here again, but what happened was, I came outside after I signed my waivers. I came out here after I signed my waivers to get something out of my trunk. When I closed my trunk, I saw like a little girl run from bit over here to over here. And I was thinking to myself, probably just the neighbors or something. So I go inside to talk to Kelly and I'm like, hey Kelly, like, is that your kid or whose kid is that on the block? She said she's very, very familiar with everyone on this area. There's no kids. So she said, where did the, where was the kid? And I explained in this exact sit, like area. Yeah. She said there used to be a well here where a little there used girl- There well right there? Where a girl fell into and died. Holy shit. That's the well right there. Mm -hmm. It's Everybody blocked off so. now. Yeah. They built a structure around it. Mm. Wow. Okay. That's crazy. And that's why you guys are up. I came out here to get some answers and I definitely got them. I'm very grateful and thank you. I've been myself sleep seeds in a very, very long time. I am dead tired, it's like 4.30 in the morning. And uh, I put the camera there, I got a light, I got a power source to keep it charged and running throughout the night. The IR lights are on some power as well. See you guys in the morning.
turned on the lights. I just had the weirdest experience ever. I was having a terrible nightmare. Like, it was the craziest thing ever. I was dreaming that I got bit by a shark. Don't know what that was all about. And then I woke up to a bright light after I got bit and my light was on in the room. I don't know what turned the light on. I'm, I'm hoping I actually got it on camera. I'm gonna review my footage before I try to go back to sleep. The light is actually on. Pretty sure, pretty sure, I'm not, I'm not 100% sure, but I'm pretty sure I fell asleep and that door was closed. Oh, I'm so tired, I just want to go to sleep. Pretty sure something did that, something in here. I'm gonna leave my camera aimed at myself over here. And I'll plug it in and then try and get more sleep. Maybe I'll capture, maybe I'll capture something else.
Huh? I don't think so. Yasko? Go check the car, I'll go check this way. Jazz! The f man? Like, I literally have no idea where this guy could be. Oh, it's too early for this. See him anywhere. Where the hell is this guy? The f Yo. Why are you, you, are right why are you out here, dude? Blanket. Can you just let me go inside? Can you tell me what's going on? Why the f*** are out here? Where are my shoes? That's what I'm wondering. Yeah, we were wondering the same thing. You're literally just standing under that light. I literally have no idea. Wait, I'm just gonna go inside. Why? Because I don't want the phone. No, no, it's not because it's not. So, why am I here? I don't know. That's what we're trying to figure out. It's all out here. I'm looking for you. Let's figure out in the morning, please. I'm so tired. I'm cold as shit. My feet are so wet. And there's no idea why you're outside. Please, Can you talk inside my feet? Are you with it right now? Oh, man. Dude, the f is going on? You feel okay? Other than what time is it? Six? I don't even know. I don't know. Being this early in the morning? Fine, I feel great. And it's pretty cold. I see that much. Does he like normally sleepwalk? I've never seen him sleepwalk before. No, no, I didn't. I don't know what to do right now. That's weird. Oh, well, thanks, bro. You. Bro, we weren't the ones outside with literally no shoes on Dude, right now. I promised you I'm fine. I'm cold as f I just want to sleep. Why can't we postpone this till the morning? Do you not understand what just happened? Yes, I'm outside. Okay. I, I don't understand what. Alright. Uh. So you're good. Everything's fine. I feel fine. Other than, like I said, being tired and cold right. and my feet are wet. Go sleep then. I don't know. Yeah, we'll talk to you tomorrow. Good night, boys. Good night. Okay. That was. I have no idea. What the hell was that all about? Like that. Just use the stay out of the light. Just let it come down. Alright. I don't know what else to do. I'll see if I can handle that situation. Bedtime, I guess. <laughs>